this loser semis match of Coltman versus uh, the Syrup. Syrup. PK boys. Minus. Minus. It's been a minute since I've seen this matchup. Nuts versus Snake. Not too bad for a snake, as most people would say. Although, although Ness can just absorb all of his explosions. It's the timing that matters on when Ness can absorb those explosions. So we'll see how Coleman fights around. Magnet, magnet, sorry. Wow. Essentially could farm rage, build up a lot of percentages on themselves and just box the character. But one bad spot could make Syrup take the stock here. As Ness can build up the damage for free on Snake with some nice offstage play. Shout out wow. to Guerrero18 adding $7 to the match arena. You love to see yeah, it. From their own money. Crazy. They just donated it again. This time, I don't think they were in the bracket today, but shout out to you, Guerrero, for donating that contribution. I think he initially was, but he couldn't play, so. Uh, okay. But yeah, thanks for the support, Holmes. Thank you. Ooh. Ooh, nice with the back air. Coltman taking that stock. Keeping up the nest. Oh, chose the shield of grenades to take it a little bit of the health back. We had Syrup on there earlier, and he was playing Lucas. Yes. So he actually plays yes. both the Earthbound kids, which, I mm, mean... PK boys. Yeah, PK boys. It's good to have both, especially for matchups. Yeah. And, like, this is a matchup that, like, uh, kind of is accepted that, like, Ness wins. Uh, at the very least, like, 6-4. He just absorbs all the explosions, which is kind of wild for me to even think about. Because I'm just like, <laughs> like all That's of them. Snake's move set. All yes, of them. Yes, all of them. Like, Literally all of them. Yeah, I'm just like, damn, all. Of them? <laughs> See, what does he do? Oh, he fights with his hands. Wow. <laughs> Sneaky little up tilt from Coltman. The movement. She throwing bombs at them at zero. Also a fine strategy. What can they absorb to get their health back? They already have their health back same time you want to hit him you're going to build up some form of percent here in order to fight here this is the start <gasps> in order to use explosives here snake has to get some nests in a situation where they can't absorb fast enough oh no gets two frame from the down smash Syrup taking game number one. All right, let's see. Great job on, on Syrup's end there. Keeping the pressure on Coltman, not letting him pull out any plans here. Kept him off stage the whole game. Coltman uh, was essentially in, in fight or flight mode off stage the whole time. That's a classic way to go. Yeah. As Snake. You gotta do something when you're a disadvantage. Mm -hmm. Everyone always states that Snake has like some of the worst disadvantage in the game. It's like, what are you supposed to do when your upbeat makes you go so slow, like just keeps you vulnerable? And that's the only way you can get back, other than saving the jump and trying to air dodge in where you can easily get two frames. <laughs> And this can reach you from like legit anywhere with that PK Thunder. And the magnet on the approach too, stopping explosives, getting their health back. So he had that C4 set up right on the platform right there. This. Oh, this could. Oh, I almost pulled the stock for them. Could not even blow up the C4 out if they tried to approach, but if they were off stage like that, they could definitely explode it. That's the late hit forward tilt there from Coltman. There's some damage. Using the turnaround explosives. Those B-reverse explosives are very helpful in order to miss 
misdirect any explosives that are thrown at us. Oh, wow, they were just right far away enough from the platform to avoid that C4. Nice. Coleman sneaks right in, lands an up tilt, takes the stock. This is now in a good spot right here. Has the C4, the Coleman set up, I'd say. C4 on the platform, grenades out, mortars out too. Ooh. He's right back on the platform. Never leaves the platform, essentially. Back throw kills. At 130. Strong enough to kill even Snake. Really good use of the explosives that are getting a little bit of damage, but they have to watch out for Ness buttons to not end up at disadvantage again. The damage builds up a lot faster for Ness. Solid blocks. Oh man. Even the armor from that Cypher has to air dodge in. Makes it, but oh the two frame, no. Right off the off the ledge. Seraph takes another stock. Looking in a really solid spot. That down tilt anti-air is very interesting as I see Coleman go for it a lot. It's a really good catch. The people's jumpings. Oh, boldly just absorbs right in their face. Making that also Ness's combo to too. too. This character has seen a lot of buffs over the years. It's a good spot for Coltman. Hits that shield drop forward tilt. Good situation off the stage. Oh, nice stock. Nice stock. Keeping it close. Keeping it evenish. Damage is building up again as Ness is able to kill easily. If you're at 100, you gotta be careful. That shield block explosive, get a little bit of damage, but missing that back air. Off the top? No. Not close. Oh, tries to push the advantage there. The dash attack. No, still not gonna kill Snake, a heavy, heavy boy. Oh, it's probably, caught yeah. him with the whiff punish. The footsies. Syrup taking that. Wins. Super scary. Snake has to put in a lot of work just to not be in such a situation as, by default, according to this matchup, this is going to look like this for Snake, where he's going to have a little bit of a tough time on an approach. As he has to rely on his buttons, his his hand to hand combat, his CQC, in order to get some damage on Ness, he can definitely get the kills, go for throws here and there. But Ness, somewhat mobile, hard to grab as easily. Ready? And Snake's main function is these, is these explosives that he needs to just to start or something. There's party starter essentially. There's walls. This is how uh, he plays the game. Wow. Wow. Four tilt. All right, so Coltman going to be running it back to Battlefield. It's 2-0. It's two oh. Let's go one. Oh, it's 2-0 oh for who? Yeah, it's 2-0. Oh. Uh, for Sarah? Sarah took two games. Yeah. Oh, okay. This is game three. Thanks. Alrighty then. Again, even though the explosives do get absorbed, it's not a bad idea to try to find some form of approach with it. It has to be different. It has to be a little more delayed, more different than how you usually throw a grenade at a character that can't deal with it. Which Coleman's doing some of a good job trying to get some damage in, but at the same time, Syrup <gasps> still builds up the percentage. Wow. Did he stick him? No. Oh. I think he oh. honestly wanted to just land and block, but he accidentally tried to air dodge or something. Wow. Scary situation. It really is. Oh my god. Thunder off the top. Syrup taking the first stock, looking to take this set. The percentage trade war is 100% in Syrup's favor Ooh. as this matchup. It's very rough for Snake. Not impossible. Never think a matchup is impossible, guys, unless you're at Ganon or something. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> He's always struggled. 
Maybe DK even. Maybe. If you play heavy, you might struggle. Yeah, yeah. Good survivability from Coleman. He's gotta fight to survive. He <laughs> tries to be reverse sticky him there, but it wasn't enough to survive, too. Uh, on stage? What are they, wow, they're sticky. We're still on them. Tries to empty jump up tilt there, but turns the other way. And good on Surf to not let go of shield in that situation, too, just to not die. Hey. Thank you, Mr. Oh. L. Pika for the sub. Let's go. Yeah. I take it you're subbing for the monthly. Hope to see you there, homie. Good looks, good looks, good looks. If you're a sub, enter the monthly, guys. If you're in, in our region lock, please yep. do. This Saturday. No tech? Oh! Try to go for something more fancy there. Back throw. Well. Essentially a free kill here for Snake. Oh, oh yeah, it's a two-low. They're going to die. Peace. Hopefully Coleman doesn't let this be the only stock they take off. Oh, it misses the grab. Oh, what a rough spot for Coleman building up all this damage on them. The farm in the range, essentially. Grabs him. Has to land this. Oh no, that's too slow. Sarah trying to find a way to land these buttons. Put that up air. Not gonna take it just yet. Bad spot for Coltman as they have to land. Oh no, scary situation. Smart on Coltman to escape. They have to choose every escape option they can. Don't want to have this next to them. If they're not hitting them. The dash attack connects. Not gonna take the stock yet, but any hit from here. Yeah, this isn't looking run. good. Oh, really bad spot for Coltman. About to hold this fourth place. Oh, still not dying yet. 180. Okay, definitely this next hit is gonna take it. Oh, the late explosion. At this point, any C4 hit that's, that Coltman does on themselves is gonna kill them. To the combo off the PK fire, and your set winner is zero. Nice. All right. Yeah, it's all three over there. Mm. Are you sure, Sensei? You sure there's even, homie? Huh? 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 No. <laughs> <laughs> not, not trying to put my man on blast. <laughs> Wait, did he say it was, did he say as much as it was even? Yeah, he was oh, like, yo, crazy. that is even. So if it is, he's putting my, he's putting Coltman on blast. And if it's not, then, like, bro, show him the secret sauce. That's what it's about. 